Sloth. This is our two-toed sloth named Penelope at the Bright's Zoo. She is currently six months old and sloths normally come from Central to South America out in the wild. Sloths live to be about 20 to 40 years old depending on if they live out in the wild or in captivity. Of course it's longer in captivity. Um, they spend all of their time up in trees and you can actually tell because they they stay upside down all the time and their hair actually grows backwards so where most animals they have the part in their hair on their back theirs is actually down their tummy and out in the wild they would also usually have moss and algae and different plants and stuff that would grow on them and when you see them out there they're actually kind of green color and they use that for camouflage and protection against predators and their biggest predators are like jaguars, eagles, and humans because we're taking over their environment and when they have babies, it takes about 7 to 10 months for her to develop the baby inside of her. And when she goes to birth it, she's going to be upside down. She's going to have her baby, and the baby's going to cling on to her with its little claws. And if at any point that baby falls off of her, she's probably going to let it go because she's not going to have time to go all the way down to the bottom of that tree to get it. And by then, there's going to be a predator that's probably already found it. Um, sloths are very slow because of the things they eat and their metabolism is so slow. They normally only eat different types of leafy greens, bark, different vegetation, sometimes fruit. And to digest all that, they have a ginormous stomach with many chambers inside of there. And it takes so long to digest it and their metabolism is so slow, that's what causes them to move very slowly. They normally weigh up to about 20 pounds, but 30% of that body weight can actually be urine and feces. They go to the bottom of the tree to defecate and urinate about once a week. They cannot crawl on the ground very well because they do have all those sharp claws. But they are actually very good swimmers. So if they want to move from tree to tree, they can either move between the trees or they can let themselves drop down to the river and float down until they find a tree they want to go up in. And to tell the difference between a two-toed sloth and a three-toed sloth is that you have to look at their front feet. Two-toed sloths only have two toes on the front two feet. Then on the back they have the three, whereas a three-toed sloth, they're going to have three toes on all their feet. And two-toed sloths are a little bit bigger.